hope you're having a nice day today. So today's video is a review of cool crutches and flexi foot. So I've already published a review of cool crutches on Instagram TV which went out on my blog's Instagram account. So you can check that Instagram TV video out and I'm going to use that video in this video but expand it a little bit to include my review of Flexifoot and just before I get started my original crutches from Cool Crutches had a fault with them so I am sending them back and they've been replaced with some other crutches which I actually chose the design myself so they are totally unique so I will now insert the cool crutches review this video is a product review of cool crutches who obviously as the name suggests the company sell crutches and walking sticks and I'll insert some pictures I do have a current pair of crutches that I've had for years they're silver and have different shades of purple dots on them and the cuff is open so it just goes round my arm rather than fully round my arm like NHS crutches which I prefer because if I fall the crutches fall away and I don't get tangled up in them when I had my NHS crutches they just weren't suitable for me aesthetically using them regularly I wanted something that expresses my personality which I find is really important when it comes to disability and aids and adaptations and things like that. I want something that expresses who I am. So I've had those purple crutches for quite a long time and I was just interested in cool crutches so I got in touch with them and they gave me a little bit of a discount. They have loads of designs there's literally a design for everybody and if there isn't a design for you you can actually design your own crutches what I like about these crutches is the adjuster for adjusting the height has a special clip so that it doesn't make a noise because with my purple crutches I have to tighten them every so often so that they don't click when I walk with them and what I like is that you can adjust the height of the length so my advice is that if you're buying crutches for the first time do it in consultation with a physiotherapist or an occupational therapist so that you know how to get the right size I was able to adjust the height for the length of my leg and what was really good is that I'm really petite and I was still able to get a size that matched my height and then also what was pretty cool about these ones that I don't have with my purple crutches is you can also adjust the arm crutch length so obviously not everyone has the same length forearm so I was able to adjust the forearm length to be the right comfortable forearm length for me. They do come with a cuff that goes around your arm but that can be taken off which is brilliant because like I said I don't like cuffs that go completely around my arm. I like something that will fall away if I need them to and these ones cool crutches come with orthopedic handles so I'm having to get my head around working out which is the right hand and which is the left hand and I didn't realize this at first but my stepmom found at the bottom of the box these neoprene covers that go over the handles so they're nice and soft and I didn't think that I would get on with an orthopedic handle on my crutches but they're really comfortable to walk with these orthopedic 
handles because obviously they're molded around not my hands but molded to a person's hands so they're kind of more there's more grip on them there's more to hold and it's kind of quite comfortable and you feel kind of quite sturdy when you're kind of putting much of your weight on them because obviously when you do struggle with mobility problems you do quite heavily well I find I quite heavily rely upon pushing down on my crutches because my legs don't have the strength in them so yeah all in all I really like these crutches and I would say the things that I am not keen on them is that the like forearm bit and the handles are black and the forearm adjuster when you heighten it it has like a silver bar I would have the forearm and handle to match the design of the crutch because my purple crutches are all kind of purple so the forearm and handle bit is purple and the ferrule at the bottom is purple to match the crutch whereas these cool crutches it's they're all black on the forearm and the ferrules black and when you pull out the leg height adjuster that's black and I would have made that bar in the design of the main crutch so there's like a little height bit here so you've got the ferrule here and then the height adjuster and then the main crutch and this bit is black and then the ferrule is black I would have this bit in the design of the navy blue and flowers so they're the only bits that I'm not too keen on just aesthetically but it's mainly the aesthetics that um, I change but yeah all in all I like them oh and the other thing that is quite difficult is one of the things I find not just with these core crutches but with the vast majority of mobility aids is how expensive they are and I mean I got a discount but there was still on the expensive side I wanted to do this review because I wanted to show people what's out there that you can that there are alternatives to NHS crutches especially if you are a regular user of crutches and I like to do product reviews especially of disability products to make people aware that these products exist and that they may help you in your life both kind of like emotionally because when you're purchasing a wheelchair or crutches or a walking stick it can be a big deal for some people and like I said at the beginning of this video for me I like mobility aids to express who I am so that when somebody looks at me they see me as a person rather than my disability and if it's something that looks quite clinical my disability looks more obvious that's just how I feel and find things I don't know whether other people find that as well so the second part of this video is my review of the flexi foot for rules so the flexi foot is a for rule that bends and the flexi foot has three components so you've got the ferrule which is the bit that you attach to your crutches and then the orange part is the flexi bit and then you've got the base which is the bit that has contact with the floor and when you walk with crutches you don't have them straight up and down you always walk at some sort of angle with them and when you walk with normal ferrules you just have parts of the ferrule making contact with the floor 
but with the flexi foots, as you can see in the picture, the base has full contact with the floor, giving you so much more stability and sturdiness when you're walking your crutches, especially if you need to put a lot of weight on your crutches or you are quite wobbly on your feet or even if you're just going on uneven surfaces or up or down slopes such as ramps and I've found since using the flexi foots that it's makes me feel more secure and sturdy because I am quite wobbly when I walk so the flexi foot gives me more contact with the ground which gives me more grounding when I'm walking and the flexi part is really flexible it comes in two colours so you either have black or grey and then the orange part is always orange aesthetically it would be nice if the whole flexi foot was black or grey just so it all blends together the price of them, I got them for free from flexi foot which was really kind of them but like I said in the cool crutches review a lot of disability products are expensive but I would say the flexi foots are actually a really good price and it is something that I would definitely recommend there are some accessories that go with the flexi foot so there's like an ice boot that you can put on the base of the crutch that gives you some grip on ice and I think I might actually buy those ice boots when it comes winter time and that's all I have to say really about the flexi foot. Thank you for watching this review. I wanted to do this review of crutches and the flexi foot to let people know that these products exist because I know for some people from some of the YouTubers that I've watched when they start to feel that they need to use mobility aids it can be a big deal for some people and having something that's fashionable in a way that's a mobility aid can really help people feel okay about using things like crutches that show off who they are as opposed to that they have a disability and need to use a walking stick or a pair of crutches and I think that's really important because sometimes people are put off from buying products because they feel like they shouldn't be needing those products and I know that from my own experience because so often when disability products are advertised they use older people as models for these products and for me it makes me think like I'm 28 should I be needing this at my age and the answer is yes because it's targeted at the elderly it makes you feel like at your age you're not ready to be using these things yet for some people and I think especially young people you want something that is stylish that is also a disability product and I think that's really important when you think of the psychology of it that's just my opinion. Let me know if you feel the same way in the comments. Do you feel like 
having a fashionable mobility aid helps you to use it or start using a mobility aid but yeah I'll leave the review there I'll leave links to the Cool Crutches website and I will also leave a link to the Flexifoot website and I just wanted to say to everybody who's subscribed to my channel thank you for subscribing especially to new subscribers my aim is to get to 100 subscribers by the end of the year so I will leave the video there and say bye for now and hope you have a nice rest of the day whatever you're up to